With every brushstroke, artists are raising awareness about the Great Smoky Mountains and also raising money. Just ahead of that event, East Tennessee students received a lesson on how to paint nature. 10 News reporter Lauren Davis shares how art is helping preserve the national park. 30 students from Fulton and Gatlinburg Pittman High Schools travel to the Great Smoky Mountains National Park to learn from the pros. Ahead of the in-person nature painting, students were also able to practice in the classrooms. Friends of the Smokies came out to our school and had a teaching artist work with the students to practice in our school garden. Um, so that was a great experience for them to come here prepared and confident and just excited instead of nervous. It's all a part of plein air, an event that brings artists from all over to paint at the national park. The chairperson of the event says artists can keep or sell their paintings and proceeds will go to Friends of the Smokies. This is really important because it tells the story of the national park. So um, it's, it's really a view of um, these incredible artists and into the what is you know so incredibly special about our national park. Rosalind Brayton says it's her second time painting for art class in the national park. She says she's using what she learned to help her with this year's painting. Last year I did not know what I was doing. Uh, typically when I paint I don't look at something like that and paint it. It takes me a bit of time to plan it out and we're kind of under a time constraint. Usually it's about, it's eight hours, which is a long time, but when you're an artist, eight hours is not a long time at all. The Fulton High School art teacher says some of her students have never been to the park before, so they were able to visit and learn new skills. And the Great Smoky Mountains National Park, I'm Lauren Davis. That event from the 21st through the 28th will draw 20 artists from across the U.S. and Europe. 